when you open up broadcaster software this, is, this should be the screen that you see everything is totally blank and let's just go through these options go to settings and you have a bunch of options here um, I typically just leave everything by default maybe you can make some adjustments later but we should go to broadcast settings and the mode, just put file output only and then you choose a file path for, uh, for your videos my stuff is uh, Logitech, I just put it here, Logitech webcam that's that's my default uh, default file uh, I give it a name of test one, I mean um, so this is this is the file name that it will be given and if area has a file name of that name it will just, at least Windows 7 you have give it 100 parentheses 1, give it 100 parentheses 2 and so on and so, so far uh, to start the stream, since uh, I think most of you guys only have one one monitor you can give it a hotkey so you can minimize this software and uh, start it what I like to do is set the stream hotkey to F9 and the stream stop hotkey, hotkey to F10. Hit OK. So this is the scene. Um, let's uh, let's make a new scene. Give it 100. Then for sources, we can add a webcam um, or whichever source you want. Video capture device, webcam. Hit OK. You don't see anything right now, but hit the previous stream or even the start recording stream and you can see something oh you can see my face with my uh, was that microphone and this is my control for my webcam so click edit scene and you have this uh, red outline that you can uh, make adjustments to and from position it whichever way you want and then add a background here add image ok give it a name use a background Pictures, pictures, pictures. So, let's choose Pokemon. Hit OK. And you can see this is a Pokemon background and it resizes to fit your screen. Um, you can resize it back like this or forward or however which. You'll notice that um, it covers my webcam. So to lower it, you think of it as in layers. And just go to order and then just move move to bottom and you're good and then so instead of stop uh, instead of preview uh, just hit start recording and this should give you uh, the file that you wish to do I mean this should give you a file that you can upload to give it 100 uh, but you didn't want uh, you can also add in a screen capture so here's add uh, monitor capture or window capture you can do window capture and then I'm going to go choose audacity and you can see how uh, this is capturing the inner window of audacity uh, you can even do monitor capture and choose, choose a screen but this is just showing you um, see how it's live updating right? There we go, we have like three or four items in one picture. And you can even add the text. Add uh, text. And then put some message here. Increase the size font, whichever you want. Give it outline. So this is kind of pixelated, but you just have to change your uh, text size. And that should be all. I think um, you're kind of set to go. And then you can have multiple scenes so that... And you can even hotkey your scenes so that if you want to go immediately from uh, one scene to another. Like, oh! You just, maybe like you can have, uh, just fully, fully have this for one window capture, like one image or video capture device. 
Yeah, you can have this fully for your webcam, or it could be your title. And then after that's your title, you just click the scene, hotkey it, and bam, this is how you transition. All right, so that should be all.